This guide shows you how to install the Windows 7 games or reinstall Windows 7 games on Windows 10. Now you might find that you've upgraded to Windows 10 and lost things like Solitaire, Spider Solitaire, Hearts, Mahjong, Minesweeper, etc. Or you may have had them on Windows 10 and Windows 10's recently done an update which has wiped them out. So this guide shows you how to install them or get the games back. Now, all you need to do is open your web browser. Now you can use any web browser with the exception of Internet Explorer. So I'm going to show you how to do this in Edge, Chrome and Firefox. So first of all, we're going to go into Microsoft Edge and just show you how to do it in that. So double click Microsoft Edge. OK. And once it's opened, go to the bar at the very top of the screen, click in it, delete out anything that might be in there. I've got nothing in mine. And then in the bar at the top of the screen we need to type winaero.com forward slash download hyphen windows hyphen seven hyphen games hyphen four hyphen windows hyphen ten and then press enter or return on our keyboard and then you'll see this page load now be careful there are a lot of download buttons on here but a lot of them are adverts so what we need to do is we need to scroll down and we need to find this download link here where it says click here to download the file move your mouse over click here to download the file left click once okay and after a couple of seconds you will see in the bottom left hand corner of the screen win seven games for win 10. now if you're using google chrome then open up google chrome and again, go to the address bar right at the very top of the screen. If there's anything in it, click in it and delete it out. And then we need to type in the address bar winero.com forward slash download hyphen windows hyphen seven hyphen games hyphen four hyphen windows hyphen ten. Then press enter or return on your key. Then when this page appears, like I say, be careful. There, there are several download buttons on here. A lot of them are adverts. So scroll down and you're looking for this download link here where it says click here to download the file. So move your mouse over, click here to download the file. Left click once. You might see an advert come up here. If you do, then click on the cross in the top right hand corner of the advert box and the download should start downloading. And if you're using Firefox, double click on the Firefox icon to open it up and go to the address bar at the top of the screen. And if you've got anything in there, click in there and delete it out. And then you need to type in there winero.com forward slash download hyphen windows hyphen seven hyphen games hyphen four hyphen windows hyphen 10. Then press enter or return on your keyboard. Then once again, please be careful. There are a lot of adverts on this page. So make sure that you click the right download button. And the right one is this one here where it says download link. Click here to download the file. Left click once. Then we need to uh, make sure that save file is selected and then we click OK. And once the file has downloaded in Chrome or Edge, you'll see that in the bottom left hand corner of the screen. And all you do is you just click on win seven games for Win 10. And if you're downloading using Firefox, you'll see an arrow in the top right hand corner of the screen. Just click on that arrow and that will give you an estimated time for download. And once it's downloaded, then all we need to do is just click on again, Win 7 Games for Win 10. Now, no matter what browser you've used, we should all be in the same place now. So uh, all we do is move our mouse over Win 7 Games for Windows 10 double left click on it and then move your mouse over extract all and left click once on it. Then move your mouse over extract, left click once. This bit might take a bit of time just to have a bit of patience here. Okay, it's now extracting the files. Shouldn't take too long. As you can see, the green bar is going up the screen. And now that box has disappeared. Again, move your mouse over Win 7 Games for Windows 10 and double left click on it. Now, Nothing might happen for a little while here, just be patient. And then you'll see, do you want to allow this app from an unknown publisher to make changes to your device? Move your mouse over, yes, left click once. And again, this bit, you might not see anything for a while, just be patient with it. And there we go, it says here, please select a language. So select your language and then left click OK. And again, this bit, the screen sort of disappears for a little while, so uh, just be patient with it. And finally, you'll see this screen appear. So move your mouse over next, left click once, OK. Uh, now, the, all these games work apart from the internet games as Microsoft have now closed down the internet game server. So move your mouse over the little 
uh, checkbox next to internet games. Left click once to remove the tick, so we're not installing those games. Doesn't matter if you leave the tick in, it's no great shakes, it's just those games won't work, so it just saves a bit of space on your hard drive by not installing them. Then move your mouse over install, left click once, and you'll see the games now start to install. Then when it's finished installing, move your mouse over the box next to Discover Win Aero Tweaker to tune up Windows 10 8.1 stroke 8, and just left click once to remove the tick out of that, because we don't need that. And then move your mouse over Finish and left click once. Okay, that gets rid of that. And then what we can do now is we can either keep the, uh, the, the games in our downloads folder or we can delete them if we want and if we want to delete them all we do is we just click downloads there just on the left hand side okay and just delete these two files here that say win 7 games for win 10 underscore 8 underscore 81 underscore v2 so just uh, click on that click the delete up there click yes and then we'll click on that one there click the delete and click yes you don't have to do this this is entirely optional and then we click on the cross just uh, up the top right hand corner of the downloads box and again the cross up there in the top of the right hand corner of the downloads box and then click on the cross in the top right hand corner of your browser to close that down and if there's any other boxes remain open again click on the cross in the top right hand corner now if you want to find the games just click on the start button in the bottom left hand corner of the screen and then scroll down to G okay and you'll see their games so there's a list of the games and let's just try one so I'm just going to try Spider Solitaire left click once on it and there we go it now loads so I hope this guide helps and I hope you enjoy your good old Windows 7 games thanks for watching you can follow me on Twitter at CW Tech that's at CW Tech on Twitter and don't forget to check out my other videos in my YouTube channel just Google Chris Wait YouTube and don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you for your support.